Hey guys, Bob Brenneman here. I'm a realtor in Mount Pleasant, South Carolina, and today we're gonna to take you on a tour of a home we recently closed here at 973 Cove Bay, overlooking the backside of Sullivan's Island, and I hope you enjoy. All right, good morning, everybody. Gonna walk y'all through a house that we recently closed uh, here at 973 Cove Bay. And for those of you not familiar, this is a a uh, unit that sits and over, you'll see it better when we get inside, overlooks uh, the backside of Sullivan's Island. And this is on Ben Sawyer Boulevard, or off Ben so Sawyer Boulevard, which is the thoroughfare that goes out to uh, Sullivan's. So I'm gonna walk you through this one. Um, so it's an inverted floor plan. You'll see we come into the, you know, this is the main entry level and you've got a bedroom here get you a little bit better view. Nope, not that. There we go. And then before we go upstairs, we'll stay downstairs. So getting back to the inverted floor plan, uh, garage entry here, we'll go there in just a second. You've got two bedrooms as you come into the, to the house. got a kind of a shared hallway uh, on suite bathroom you can see here Oops, sorry and then really you know the big portion of the uh, value in this this place is the view oh man it smells smells like salt air out here this is a great spot so so out there, you know, that's Sullivan's Island in the distance. And we get upstairs, I'll get you a better shot of the uh, harbor, but it's just Charleston Harbor's just down that way. And this sits next to uh, Simmons Point, which I really like Simmons Point. You can see the sun's coming up and uh, that's Isle of Palms out in the distance. Uh, Simmons Point's next door. Uh, they were built in the 80s. Uh, these were built in probably mid 2000s, if I remember serves me correct, the ones we're in right now. Uh, but if you like this, and there's not too many of these Cove Bay ones that come on the market, because there's just not that many. Simmons Point is just up the uh, marsh line, and that would be one that uh, you may see a few more coming on market. I actually probably have one coming on pretty soon. It's a freestanding house uh, over there. So anyway, back to this house. We are uh, down in the garage area. So, you know, it's a... It, would say probably a triple bay garage. You could put three cars in here if you stacked them. Uh, room for a golf cart. You do have an elevator down here. We won't call it, but it starts here and goes all the way to the top, which is a big plus. I mean, most developers developing these things probably since mid 2000s um, have, you know, developed them with, it, with uh, elevators. And then you're on the, you know, the main level, you've got this little porch out here. And you get along the marsh line. But the thing I like about, you know, the elevator construction, I say it all the time, is you, you do have this full footprint of the house, uh, the townhouse in this, this instance, to store things in. I won't open it, that's just a closet, and those is, that's the uh, laundry. So we go up another flight of stairs, and we're gonna get to the, kind of the main, excuse me, main level of the house. And, you know, again, inverted floor plan, very popular to build, that they build down here uh, in the Charleston area, around the beaches, and, you know, around the marsh. And you'll get a better view here in a second of one out to uh, Sullivan's Island. And then again, you know, you've got three sets of porches. You'll have this one, or really four if you count the one on the ground level. Let's see if I zoom in. You can kind of see, you know, you got Crab and Dock. Crab and Dock Simmons Point is not in the Crab and Dock for here, but I hear people over here use it. So don't tell the Simmons Point people that though. So I'm shooting this a couple of days before Labor Day. Man, it's humid out there today. 
So powder bath. And then kitchen. Kitchen, I think they're planning to redo this kitchen, is what my contractor friend says. At least they're gonna talk about it. I mean, I think it's, I think it's still got legs. Uh, right there is the elevator. Again, it's a one, two, three stop elevator, four stop elevator rather. And then we go up. And up here is the is the master, the main level, the primary suite is the politically correct, like to call it. Um, And the whole, again, this whole area up here is the main bedrooms. Um, and then into the bathroom, travertine, surround. And a nice closet. Elevator that goes straight into this level. You got the double French doors. Sorry, John. I think I panned too quick. That's for my friend John Koska. He always tells me when I do these videos, uh, which I've been a little slack on doing, uh, that I pan too fast. So if I'm giving y'all whiplash, my apologies. up to the main level so i mean the tide right now just fyi is probably halfway out so you you may see over there um you know you can see some pluff mud which is you know common obviously when the tide goes out but most of the time during the day you're gonna have quite a bit of water back here let's see if i can zoom in so you can probably see way out in the distance uh past the dock and the next set of water uh, out there is charleston harbor so very close to that. Again, you can hear the uh, seagulls, but just a beautiful spot, man. I, I love these, and hopefully my clients get a lot of use out of it. All right, y'all, that's a wrap. Again, my name is Bob Brenneman with the Brenneman Group. If you like our videos, be sure to click in the right-hand corner of the screen to subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you have questions about the area, you can call me, Bob Brenneman, at 843 three, four, five, six, zero, seven, four, or you can uh, text me to that same number. And if you want to connect with us via the web, brennemangroup.com is our main website for all of Charleston. And I hope y'all have a great day until next time.